Hello dear students, in this video we will learn what are corresponding angles. As you can see that uh, here I have taken two lines L and M and they are intersected by another line L, N. And this line N is called transversal. So we are going to understand about what are corresponding angles. So corresponding angles are the angles that are in the same relative position at an intersection of the transversal and at least two of the lines. So here you can see I am marking some angles. So let me mark this angle and let us take this angle as angle 1 and I am marking another angle here I am taking this angle as angle 2. So this pair of angle, angle 1 and angle 2 is corresponding angle. So as you can see that the they are at the same relative position at an intersection of the transversal N and the lines L and M. Can you find some other pair of corresponding angles? Okay, let us locate it. If I mark here angle 3. Yes, tell me another angle which is at the same relative position at the intersection of the transversal and the line. Yes, you are right. Angle 3 and angle 4 are making a pair of corresponding angles. Let me take another example. Can we find some more pair of angles which are corresponding angles? Observe here angle 5. Here I've marked angle 5. Now can you quickly tell me the angle which is at the same relative position at the intersection of the transversal N and the line M. Yes, you have got it. This is angle number 6. Good job. Okay. Can we find some other angle? Another pair of corresponding angle? Yes, there is one more pair of corresponding angles. Here I am marking angle 7. And corresponding to it, there is another angle, angle 8. So you tell me how many pairs of corresponding angles are there? Yes, there are four pairs of corresponding angles. The first pair is angle 1 is corresponding to angle 2. And second pair of corresponding angle is angle 3 is corresponding to angle 4. Observe them carefully. Angle 3 is corresponding angle to angle 4. And angle 5, see the position of angle 5? Yes, angle 5 is corresponding angle to angle 6. So this is another pair of uh, corresponding angles. And which is the fourth pair of corresponding angle? Yes, you are right. The fourth pair of corresponding angle is angle 7 and angle 8. So, my dear students, here you see that when a pair of lines is intersected by the transversal, then four pairs of corresponding angles are formed. I hope it is clear to all of you.